We've got Laura and Holly covering the two teams. Laura is with the reigning champions, and we'll start there. Yeah, Reese, believe it or not, Kirby Smart actually has the number one Bulldogs believing and convinced that they're disrespected. He said his message to this team was, why should Ohio State have an advantage because they lost their last game? He said, no, forget that. That's disrespectful <laughs> to you guys who won the SEC championship and continued dominance throughout this season. Now, one of the things here is you got to think reverse psychology sometimes works for motivation. But either way, this Georgia team will tell you they're motivated no matter what because of the comparisons to last year's championship team and along those lines Stetson Bennett says he feels this year he's more confident he's more in control a lot of the differences in their offense have to do with his maturity at the position and one of the big keys there is the comfort factor with his leading receiver Lad McConkey. McConkey has practiced all week he's dealing with both knees being injured but he will be available today huge news for the Georgia Bulldogs as they look for all the weapons possible against Ohio State let's go to Holly Rowe with the Buckeyes. Ryan Day delivered a passionate and emotional speech to his team this week. His message, rarely in life do you get a second chance. How will you handle yours? He was so emotional. He said, it might be corny, but I still want to impact these young men's lives and help them handle adversity. He also told them a very poignant story about what real adversity looks like. After going on a children's hospital visit this week here in Atlanta, he met a parent who had been just told that their child might have only a few hours left to live. He said, that's real adversity. We need to remember that and go out and have fun and enjoy what we're doing. C.J. Stroud has embraced that message. His quarterback has started leading in a way that he hadn't all season long. Players told me he's had an edge. He's holding them accountable and making them really do their job in practice each and every time. And last but not least, they are going to come to this stadium. By the end of the show, you'll see the Buckeyes out on the field here today. They are going to come for what's kind of like a play date. Get out of the hotel room, get moving around on this field, have fun and live some life before they lock in and get that edge for tonight. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.